everyone. Thanks for watching my video. Um, yeah, this is my first of many. I'm very excited to record and, you know, get my videos out there. I probably look, seem so nervous right now, but it's because I am. And this is my first video. I just really want my YouTube account and just like all my social medias just to inspire and to really just get, I don't know, just be myself and you know, show who I am through my videos and there'll be, you know, music, makeup, different stories that, you know, I've gone throughout my life, um, just different things that I want to talk about and, you know, maybe I can share my story with some of you guys and, you know, maybe you guys can relate to some of the things I've gone through or we could both relate or even then I would just love to hear, you know, you guys the story and you know just really be there for you and you know not just be about makeup and only on that I want to be about everything and really just be myself as much as I can even though I'm like really nervous right now but um again thank you so much for watching and if you aren't subscribed please subscribe and um check me out on Instagram and blogger and Facebook, you know, let's be friends, let's talk, let's chat, um, yeah, but that's all, thank you guys so much again for watching, and thank you for my friends and family who have pushed me and, you know, told me to quit being a baby and just make this page already, shout out to y'all, y'all are great, um, thank you again, I'm so happy that I can have this opportunity to share what I love to do, and just different things that go on with you guys. So, again, thank you so much for watching and subscribing, and see you next time. And here I am being a dork, as always. Um, <laughs> just doing different poses and faces. Don't really know what to do. Starting off with the Lush Lotion to moisturize my face. It's a really great moisturizer. Uh, I usually get dry skin around my nose ring, so I like to just put lotion everywhere before I do my makeup and, you know, keeps me dewy and not so like matte looking and dry looking. So then I am taking the NARS Orgasm Highlighter and actually use that as a primer to make my skin very glowy and uh, luminous. So yeah, I just put that everywhere and I'm singing so you might see me talking a little bit throughout the video. I'm just singing and yeah. <laughs> So then I take my Mario Badescu spray in cucumber water and spray it over to just prep my face for some foundation and makeup that I'm about to put on. Next I'm taking the Anastasia Brow Wiz in chocolate and just filling in my eyebrows. I like the Brow Wiz sometimes when I'm going more for a natural brow, not too crazy, not too, you know, heavy. One thing I notice is that I always put my pinky up like that whenever I'm doing my eyebrows and I don't I don't understand why I do but So now I'm about to just take some concealer that I have and I'm going to just clean up under my eyebrow. Um, try to give it a more structured and clean look.
display my great lip singing in this clip right here. There I go, yep. So now I'm taking the Anastasia Beverly Hills palette in Modern Renaissance and I'm putting tempera all over my lid just to give it, you know, just a regular base color. Then I'm taking burnt orange and putting it all in my crease and actually get really annoyed with this brush. It just did not want to blend. Pretty sure I like stale face the camera in a clip soon. There's a stale face for y'all. <laughs> yeah, I was just done with the brush, so I switched over to I switched over to a Wet and Wild brush um, and just picked up some more burnt orange and just put it back again in my lid. And keep blending until your hand falls off, cause yep. Yeah, just keep blending. And now I'm taking regular and putting that again in my crease just to deepen it up some. And then I take the Lorac Pro Mega 2 palette and I put tangerine in my crease. Then I am spraying my brush with some of the Mario Badescu spray. And again in the Mega Pro palette, I am taking Penny and putting that all over my lid. Then I go into the Modern Renaissance palette and I pick up Cypress Umber and I put that in the outer half of my lid. And just keep blending it all in, you know, you gotta take your time and just blend. Going back in with Penny and just making it um, more bronzier on the lid and taking it up a little bit higher. Back in the Mega Pro palette, I pick up Moonstone and put that on my eyebrow.
then I just pick up some concealer and put it under my eyes. Then I take the LA Girl Foundation in Fair and I put that all over. It's a great foundation. It's definitely buildable. Um, one layer is about medium coverage and let it dry. You can add a whole other layer and just keep going full coverage. I just take my Real Technique brush and just start buffing it all in. Then I take my Real Technique sponge with the Airspun facial powder and I um, start baking underneath where I would place my contour. And I just take some and put some under my eyes, the way it is increased. I like going in with a sponge and doing it under my eye because it moves my foundation away from creasing and just really gets the powder in there. Then I pick up the Smashbox bronzer palette I have and another Real Technique brush and just start contouring and bronzing. Then I take the Tarte blush in Party and I just put that all over and I had a hair in my face from the brush so yep just start putting blush on my cheekbones then I just wipe away the powder I have underneath and really just set it into my skin Then I go into the Urban Decay Spectrum palette and I pick up the color Deep End and run that underneath my eye and do a little flick to where I would have eyeliner but I just use the eyeshadow instead to flick it up. And I got a lot of powder in my eyes so I make that face because it just messed with my contacts, contact problems. <music> Then I go back in with Moonstone and put that in the inner corner of my eyes, but also a little bit underneath my eye too, towards the tear duct. Then I take my House of Lashes glue and just run that all on the Ardell Double Up Glamour Lashes. And these 
eyelashes have been through a lot. So I know throughout the video, towards the end, my eyelashes are like coming off. It just, the lash band just did not want to work with me tonight at all. But you know, I made do with what I had. Then I pick up this sample Tarte um, lipstick in Birthday and I put that all over my lips. So then I pick up my favorite lip gloss. It's in Sugar Sugar by Marc Jacobs. And I put that all over my lips. It's so comfortable and so worth it. So worth the price. And this is my finished look. Thank you again so much for watching. And subscribe if you aren't subscribed. 